Hey guys, it's Kerry. I'm featuring my Asian bear's first Asiatic bear. This figurine is by Bully Land. It was made in 2012 and retired in 2015. The Asian flag bear lives in family groups consisting of two adults and two successive litters of young. They will walk in a procession of largest to smallest. They are great climbers of rocks and trees and will climb to feed, rest, sun, get away from enemies and to hibernate in their colder northern ranges. They spend half of their life in the trees and are one of the largest arboreal mammals. Sloth bear it has a long lower lip and palate used for sucking up insects. It has long shaggy fur, a mane around the face and long sickle shaped claws. Lion. They have no actual predators but they have a few natural enemies such as hyenas and cheetahs. Hyenas compete with lions for food and often try to steal their kills. Human beings are the major threat to a wild lion population. Jaguar, they employ an unusual killing method. They bite directly through the skull of mammalian prey between the ears to deliver a fatal blow to the brain. Tiger, they are strong and powerful predators. Their beautiful orange and black striped coats provide camouflage when hunting prey at night. Florida Panther, their method of hunting is to get behind and close to their prey, then launching a short spring attack to their prey. Zebra, biting and kicking are a zebra's defense tactics. When threatened by lions, zebras flee and when caught, they are really effective in fighting off the big cats. Giraffe, despite its long neck and legs, the giraffe's body is relatively short. Located at both sides of the head, the giraffe's large bulging eyes give a good all-round vision. Okapi, with reproduction, once a male and female meet, the male gets close to the female to sniff her genital area. Courting pairs stand parallel to one another with their heads facing opposite directions to sniff and lick each other. Both males and females then urinate and smell the markings of their partners using the flea response. Once the female accepts the male, she lowers her head and moves her tail aside to assist in copulation. The male will mount her from behind. In the male, the testes are scrotal and the penis is fibroelastic, much like that of a goat. Snow leopard, I love their tail. They use it to wrap around themselves for added warmth. The tail can be up to one meter in length. Gariel, it is well adapted to catching fish because of its long thin snap and 110 very sharp interlocking teeth. Only the males have the bulbous snout. During courtship they produce a loud buzzing noise and a hissing sound and also jaw slapping to attract a female. When a female finds a male they will rub each other with their snouts. Tapir. It has a long flexible proboscis. Four toes on each front foot and three toes on each back foot. They have poor eyesight, so rely greatly on their excellent sense of smell and hearing to go about in their everyday lives. Please stay, 
and watch another video with me. I love to read your comments. Thank you for watching my video. See you again soon. See you guys in my next video.